undefeated in conference and MAC tournament champions, the Quinnipiac women's basketball team has all the reasons to celebrate. After last season's improbable Sweet 16 run, the Bobcats will try to make noise once again, this time as a nine seed and facing the Miami Hurricanes for the second year in a row. Smart play on the committee's uh, part, really creating that interest and intrigue and obviously playing a revenge uh, seed a little bit for Miami. You know, we played them last year, still pretty fresh. You know, we're familiar with their personnel and how they play, so I think it'll be a fun matchup. Right now, the Hurricanes are on the forefront of the Bobcats' minds, especially with it being a revenge game for Miami. But if Quinnipiac advances to that second round, it is number one overall seed in women's basketball dynasty, UConn, that awaits. Great basketball in the state of Connecticut. That would be one heck of a great, fun atmosphere game to be a part of if we can make it to see the second round. Well, right now we take a game by game, so we're going to focus on Miami, but uh, it's always good uh, to play the best team ever. This is Quinnipiac's fourth trip to the NCAA tournament in six years, but the nine seed is the highest in school history. The committee rewarded us for our body of work all season long, especially what we did in the non-conference and then obviously what we were able to do in the conference. So that was really that was really incredible to see tonight. You know, no one was really expecting that coming in um, to today, but it just speaks to how hard we've worked all season. We were rewarded with a really high seed, so we're excited about it. Although it's no warm and sunny spring break destination for the Bobcats, they're glad to play just 60 minutes from home. I, mean, I think everyone obviously wants to go away, you know, fly somewhere, but thinking about it, I mean, we're going to have a lot of people rooting for us there. I think even UConn, will, they'll be rooting for us in that first game, so I think it'll be a lot of fun to really pack the house. Reporting from Hamden, Sierra Goodwill, Q30 Sports.